I'm really excited to be able to share with you guys a quick hands-on and impressions of the brand new Razer for 2023. Now, this is Motorola's, uh, I would say, more affordable function, well, more affordable option between the Razer and the Razer Plus. We don't have a pricing or of obviously availability yet. The launch is a little bit later on. But the main thing I will say this, first and foremost, the experience is not hindered on the inside. 144 hertz, uh, the 7th uh, Gen 1 processor, 8 gigs of RAM, 128 gigs of internal storage, 30 watt charging, 5 watt wireless charging. Um, actually, I'm not sure of the 5 watt but overall you know 30 watt charging still slightly larger battery than we get there uh, 144 hertz on the refresh rate and of course the ability of shooting 4k on the front and on the main sensor a lot of main things that you truly appreciate about having this of course to top it off we have wireless ready for which means i can project the uh, basically uh use desktop experience uh leveraging the power of the 7 uh, gen 1 and of course doing more with our devices this is going to be launched a little bit later on than the uh, the razor plus for 2023 uh but of course let me know what you guys think about this this is a quick hands-on and initial impressions i'm really excited to see what moto is doing for foldable specifically flip phones in 2023 with the razor and the razor plus